Panthers have taken the lead. The Florida Panthers are giving South Florida a serious case of playoff hockey fever. Panthers come to Toronto, win both. I think we could be good mojo for the Florida Panthers. Good mojo, or at least good luck, which makes sense since the Lucky Pucks Hockey Club has some recent championship experience of its own. Well, we swept for Florida, for novice rec and for all three divisions, and we went to U.S. Nationals in Tampa, and we won for Nationals. Karen Oda O'Brien is credited with putting women's hockey on the map here, co-founding the Florida Women's Hockey League back in 2002. She's everything. If you know hockey in Florida, you know Karen. If you know women's hockey, you know Karen. Girls, we treat you okay? Yeah. yeah. And now even more hockey fans nationwide are getting to know Karen. She is one of three finalists for the NHL's Community Hero Award. I was touched that they nominated me for this award. Karen grew up in Canada, but ironically didn't start playing hockey regularly until she moved to Florida. I grew up on a cattle ranch, but I never played any hockey till I moved here. We got a front row seat to a lucky puck scrimmage in Coral Springs. I started playing hockey when I was six because all my friends were doing it in New Jersey. It's incredible. I have found this family outside of work. Honestly, it's the camaraderie of this team and the support that we're able to get. Whether it's weddings, divorces, bad relationships, surgeries, we're all there to help each other out. Without Karen, this would probably all fall apart. She holds us all together. I think more than sisterhood, it's family. It's our chosen family and it's incredible that we all get to experience that. These women, they're from all ages, different backgrounds, they're from the military coast guard to stay-at-home moms to lawyers to district attorneys. I'm proud of them all. A proud hockey trailblazer who has no plans to stop expanding the game she loves in South Florida. Good goals, ladies! I'd like to work with the underprivileged kids, get them into these rinks, provide a safe place for them like I have for women, but for maybe for kids. And for these players, there always remains one common goal. It's to chase around that one little black puck for an hour. <laughs> Twice a week, Lucky Pucks host what they call Girls Night Out for women of all skill levels ages 18 and up. We have more information on our website. As for the Community Hero Award, the NHL will announce the winner on June 26th. Karen Hensel, 7 News.